right, um, so we're gonna mount this landing to the beam and kind of get it set up in place. Yeah, and I wasn't sure whether you wanted to use the longer or the uh, shorter for the new um, for the, the ledger locks. locks. Yeah. Well, whenever I'm doing it, um, if I got the beef to put into, I'll do it. So let's use the fives. Um, even though we're going through an inch and a half, the three and five eighths and five is fine. But since you, you can make them work, let's go ahead and use the fives. Okay. All Excellent. right. Cool. So let's grab a couple clamps, and I think we can kind of tempt this thing up, and then um, we'll grab a couple levels and kind of get it. Oh, sweet. Kind of get it somewhat um, located where we want it. So now, Andy, um, yeah. it's looking pretty tight. So as long as the two by six is tight up against the bottom of the joist, then I can ram let's it lock it in okay. and do one on the right, one on the left before you start doing everything. Okay. And then we'll double up the ends and then do high, low. Like boom, boom. Yeah. Go a little closer to the edge. Come in, Yeah. Oop. Yeah. There you go. Yep. And I don't know if you need a hammer or you're good. There you go. I think you got this from here. Um, you know, you mark your holes, dig them. You know, we're going for like 12, 12 by 16 to 20 inches deep. Right, let's just um, run a level from this corner straight down, do a circle you, around it. Yeah, I would draw, what I do is I, I level down from this side, I level down from this side and this side. And then you know your two corners. And then you gotta, you know, obviously you gotta get concrete further around it than that. We're not going to, um, we're gonna do the post like this. We're gonna still use brackets and all that. Mm -hmm. So um, you don't have, we're not sinking the post in the ground, but we still want the post to be centered in the concrete. Okay. Okay. Yeah, all so right. just a regular 12 inch then we'll do it. 12 inch diameter. Yeah, you can actually use a sono tube as a, as a, as right. a guide. Yeah. That, that's what I would do. Okay. Yeah. So. Digging your grave. <laughs> yeah. We're working on uh, getting the holes dug for our six by six posts that are gonna go level from here, straight down. And then this hole is gonna be like 24 inches deep and we're gonna put a concrete uh, bracket for the six by six post in the concrete and then we'll attach the six by six post to that bracket. Um, and then once the posts are installed, the concrete's dried, then we'll be able to get the stairs coming from here and going down. Concrete time. This is uh, the Dr. Dex one of a kind mixer. It is two different mixers put together. The bottom half is from an extremely old mixer that the boss man just couldn't let go. And the top half is from a brand new mixer that we picked up from Lowe's. So, one of a kind. with a little bit of water and then you can hear it start to start moving on the inside and 
Yeah, I'm just gonna let this mix for a second so that it's thoroughly mixed all the way through. Um, and once I get the concrete in the hole, then we'll shove the brackets in, and then we'll add a little bit more concrete on top of that to make sure that uh, everything is level and filled up. And your dad wanted it a little uh, thicker, so the way it is right now, should be pretty close to perfect. We need a little more concrete. All right, cool. What's the hay for? The hay is going to keep, it's, gonna, it's supposed to get down into sub-zero or uh, freezing temperatures tonight. So the hay is gonna help insulate the concrete so it doesn't freeze. All right, so that's done and uh, this will be cured up tomorrow and we'll be able to start building on it. All right, so we got this landing framed up today. We got concrete in the holes, concrete's poured, posts are in, all the brackets are in. So this is be, this will be ready for us to hang a staircase on tomorrow, which I still need to cut out and do. But at least this is done, and we're making progress on our upper stairs. Uh, Phil's putting in the fascia boards right now. I'm gonna cut those, trim those, and um, put those in. And then we'll be ready for lights for tomorrow. As long as I bring some low voltage wire, we'll get those in. And hopefully I'll start cutting out some stair jacks for this set here. We really want to get uh, this staircase done so we can start using it to go up and down the stairs because we're getting tired of climbing ladders up and down, up and down. So looking forward to having that done. And then we'll start trimming and finishing off the inside treads of our uh, staircase that connects the lower deck to the upper deck. From there, we have some benches to build and then some privacy screens to install and that kind of thing. Then we have a little bit more Regal Ideas railing to put in, uh, some glass pickets, that kind of thing. So still quite a bit to do here, but uh, we're making some progress. Just, just roll. Okay. <sighs> Click subscribe, because I said so. So thanks for watching. If you like it, please click subscribe. And don't forget, and if you like it, click subscribe. And if you don't mind clicking that little bell icon, that'll make some noise over there. And then you can't hear what I'm saying over here. So if you like it, click subscribe. <laughs> Keep rolling. So if you like it, click subscribe and hit that little bell icon if you want to be notified every time we put up new content. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Like and comment. Don't forget that. Oh, well, keep rolling. Did you cut it? You could have.